Wisconsin. Hi. So today I'm gonna to be answering questions of studying abroad. Ever since I was a young girl, my mom encouraged me to study abroad, mainly because she didn't have the opportunity to in college, and we would constantly watch Rick Steves go to Europe and Samantha Brown's passport to Europe, all focused on Italy. So I knew that was the first stop to go. Next, I decided to go to Paris, France, because I wanted to ever since high school after taking two French language courses. And to this day, I still don't know which trip I like better. While in Italy, we cooked together, we ate together, we laughed together. It was a very family-oriented atmosphere, and it reminded me much of my own. We got to visit beautiful vineyards and ancient wine cellars. Oh yeah, and while in Paris we got some extra days off and I got to visit Berlin, Germany. That's me trying to sing. While in Paris I saw some of the most beautiful architecture in the world. But I couldn't help but think why my own ancestors didn't have the same idea. Why did the Navajos not want to build large castles or create paintings and many other things? This has led me to the realization that I had such a rigid perspective in high school. I thought that there was only one path that led to success and happiness in life. However, during my travels, I have experienced a different happiness. If you found a purpose or passion for something, then there's not a wrong or right way to live life. And if you haven't found someone with the same understanding, I believe you will. You may just have to travel a little to find them.